Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel, Ria Maria. How are you all doing? I have a very interesting topic for you today. Guess what? One of my subscribers requested to see my old Louis Vuitton uh, bag collection. Remember on my last video, it's been like a few months, when I talk about what's in my bag and the bag that I showed you in that video was my graceful bag uh, by Louis Vuitton. She was very interested in that bag and she messaged me. We've talked a lot about if I'm still happy with the bag, if I still like the bag. And then uh, she asked me if I have uh, another bag by Louis Vuitton. She would love to see the bag collection collection before making up her mind and purchasing that one the graceful I think it was the PM graceful bag I was sold I want to help you out so this is why I've decided to become a youtuber to give you good reviews and to talk about a little bit of fashion a little bit of high-end a little bit of makeup, a skincare, drugstore items. By the way, before I start this video, I would like to say I have a very big uh, bag collection, but this lady specifically, she wanted to see the Louis Vuitton collection. So let's do it today and let me share with you the first bag that I bought, Louis Vuitton. Uh, but you know what? I was just thinking that I do need my phone to remind me of some of those bad names. I know, bad memory. But uh, let me grab my phone and I'll get back to you. As we all know, Louis Vuitton has a big collection uh, of different styles, different kinds, whether they are the shoulder, the hobo, the uh, crossbody. But usually whenever I'm gonna purchase something expensive, I like to go classical, I'd like to go with their own signatures, like this brand signature. And of course, Louis Vuitton pattern is well known. You either go with the monogram or you go with the damier. Excuse my French, uh, pardon my French, I don't speak French, I'm not good at French, I can never sound good in French. So the Damier or Damier, Damier, I'm not sure, is this one here. Those are the two color uh, squares, dark brown and uh, like mocha shade. So the first bag that I wanted to buy from Louis Vuitton was this baby here. This is my baby. This is my first bag. Uh, and this one is called Alma PM. This is the very first bag that I own by Louis Vuitton. It's the first one that I love because just like you now, I was watching YouTube and of course I have a lot of YouTubers that are my favorite. I love them. I love their taste. So this lady was talking about this bag and I got tempted because of its shape, because of the way you carry it. Very lady, very classy. And since I never had a high-end or brand name bag back then at that time, I wanted to buy me this one with the red interior from inside. And this one is quite big, you guys. You can fit a lot of stuff in there. Let me show you. Of course, this comes in two sizes or maybe three sizes uh, in MM, PM, and there is the third one, I believe. This is the middle one. This is the PM. I'm not sure about the sizes, but mine is not the smaller version because this comes in a smaller version, the baby version. This is not that one, obviously, because like I always tell you, I am not that petite woman. So with all due respect to all my petite ladies out there, so I want something to show on me. Whenever I wear something, I carry something, I would like it to show on me. Otherwise, I don't buy it. So this one was the medium version and this is called Alma. Alma doesn't come with the larger strap. It just comes with those two mini baby handles. Although there is a strap that is sold separately that you can purchase your own and it has hooks. Let me show you. Please welcome Alma. And Alma has a little tiny hooks on those handles from inside where you can um, 
add the larger strap for crossbody. Do you see those? Okay, so that's what I did. I wanted to hold this sometimes with the handles depending on the place that I go. And of course, do you see that gold tone zipper? And check the interior. So anyway, I grabbed the strap because I felt like uh, being a mom with two boys, I badly needed this strap for crossbody. And so let me hook it up. It's strange how it comes with those hooks, but they don't include the strap with the bag, you guys. The strap is something you purchase your own. And just like that, you hook it in and now voila, you can carry it crossbody. So this is, uh, this is a separate purchase, doesn't come with the bag. As for the prices, I will be including the links below. You can go click the link, see the price and shop for the bag that you like. But this was baby number one from Louis Vuitton in my collection, in Maria's closet. So that's that. After like two years maybe or less, uh, it was my birthday and of course my husband wanted to get me something. Like I told you, he's the one usually tells me, uh, choose your gift and get it. I chose the second bag by Louis Vuitton and it was, can you guess? This baby here is called a Speedy Bandoulier 25. Uh, but this time, since I had the canvas on the first one, the Demier, Demier, I'm not sure if I'm saying it right again. Excuse my French. But since I had this in Demier um, prints, I wanted to go for a change. I didn't want to get the same pattern canvas on the Speedy Bandoulier. So I got the Bandoulier in the Empreinte leather. This is their expensive version of bags because of the leather. Let me show you. And this one, by the way, comes with two handles and the larger strap for crossbody. Yay! Speedy Bandoulier. This comes in 25, size 25, because it, there is another Speedy bag that comes larger than this. That one is not Bandoulier, it's just a Speedy, and that one is 30. So I bet the 30 is larger than this one. But I feel like 25 is really good. I mean, I don't feel the need to go bigger, larger bag. And the leather on this one, you guys, so nice, very soft. At first when you buy this leather the emprunt it is very very stiffy but then the more you use it the softer it gets the better look it gets see that slouchy look i love it i love it you guys and of course it has the nails so you won't scratch the leather whenever you put it on the floor on the ground in your car i love that it has those nails it has the gold hardware and you can detach the um, the strap you can go just by those uh, handles by the way as for the color this color was limited edition uh, you don't see this color anymore they don't do it in this color they have another colors like black navy maybe burgundy I'm not sure but back then this was the color I chose I feel like uh, this was mocha yeah, I, I remember the color was mocha. Well, mocha is discontinued. It was limited edition color and I love, love, love the color, love the leather, how soft it gets after carrying it a few times. Like the more you use this, the leather gets even better. I don't know what's the secret. Let me show you uh, the interior, but first let me hook this again on it because usually I love to carry my bags crossbody. So here's my second bag by Louis Vuitton and here is the interior. It has stripes. Sorry, maybe the inside is kind of dirty because this is something I carry a lot, you guys. I carry a lot. This bag has been worn a lot, a lot. It's very, very, very good quality. It holds a lot of stuff inside. 
uh, I mean, you can fit a lot of things in there, a lot of things, your phone, your phone charger, uh, your big wallets uh, or like long wallets. Um, you can fit a lot. I will be linking everything down below in my description box. You can click and it will navigate you to the item and the price. After a few months of that purchase, it was my son's uh, christening or baptism. So I wanted something that would match my dress and I didn't want it to be something big or slouchy or everyday type of bag. But yet I want it to be sport chic. Whenever you are going to spend all that money, you better think twice. You better buy something that's going to be multi-use, multi-time wear. Uh, you don't want something you carry it once and then you throw it in your closet and this is it you guys. All my bags are well worn I use them a lot on daily basis and uh, remember I have kids so you can imagine uh, how many stuff I carry in those bags all my bags are very well used worn carried that I don't regret spending any penny on those these are my investments these are something I use every day with no hesitation and I'm very happy with my choices those bag collection okay so moving on to the third bag in my collection by Louis Vuitton it is called uh, where's my phone the favorite MM by the way I keep all the receipts I keep all the bags and I keep all the dust bags too don't laugh at me I'm very very careful when it comes to my bag I take care of them as my own babies because whenever you're spending all that money on items like bags or leather or something expensive you better take good care of your belongings so these are my babies my bag collection is my baby i take care of it really good i don't like to abuse my bags <laughs> they're expensive and i take good care of them anyhow so this is the favorite uh, m m m m i like that one but it's m m this is the one you guys this is no surprise i carried this for my son's baptism i felt like it has this gold accent to it that makes it very classy chic but yet it's very very sport uh, casual let me show you a close-up it comes with the longest strap for crossbody, but whenever it's uh, I wanted to wear this more on the chic side, I try to take the strap off and then I just carry it with this short gold handle or chain handle that makes it so classy, you guys. Again, I got it in the print canvas damier. It's not the monogram and a red interior. And this is the back from inside. You can fit a long wallet here, your keychain, your uh, so many stuff, you guys. This is like really big from inside and it fits a lot. It has a magnetic closure, unlike the other two over there. They're um, zipper closure, but this one is magnetic. Do you hear that? And like I said, the strap is uh, your choice. You can take it off. It has a hook here. And you can hold it from its uh, chain handle. And it's so beautiful. Very chic. No hesitation. This was my third bag. Now moving on to my fourth and last that one is not something new to you because i've shared that in what's in my bag and this is how i got the request on filming my louis vuitton collection so here we go let me put this in the dust bag and we'll be back to baby number four it is called the graceful uh let me see graceful what uh graceful mm again this is the small size mm and it comes in pm pm is the bigger version which i didn't like i preferred the small one because it's quite big and i'll show you now here is the baby that i'm talking about this is graceful you guys please meet graceful uh i showed you this bag in my what's in my bag video 
and I got a lot of comments, a lot of views. People were very interested uh, to know more, to hear more, to learn more before like making their own purchases. So here is the one. This is my everyday bag, my shopping bag, whenever I'm in a hurry because of the magnetic closure. See that? It has here two magnets. This one is really big, you guys. You can fit so many stuff. This is why this is my shopping bag. Of course, I have a hand sanitize. It's a shoulder bag. Do you see that? And of course, if you want to know more about this bag, uh, you can watch what's in my bag in my few months ago video. And this one has a raspberry interior. It's not red. It's more of fusion raspberry berry color, the interior. So it's really big from the inside. You can fit a lot of stuff, you guys. I got it in the monogram. It's not the damier. This is the monogram. And just for a change, you know, because I do have a lot of damier print. So I wanted to go canvas monogram and very happy with this bag. Again, this bag has been worn a lot, you guys. And of course, it says Louis Vuitton on the handle on top of the handle where it goes this this is the part where it goes on your shoulder so here it says Louis Vuitton Paris this is the fourth and the last bag from Louis Vuitton which one is your favorite you guys tell me tell me please I would like to hear your opinion what do you think which one is your favorite which one you think you can buy or like you can get encouraged and make the purchase because these are not affordable these are not um i mean those are brand names of course they're not going to be a hundred bucks you know anyhow this is my louis vuitton collection now like i told you i have a back collection if you are interested to see the rest of the back collection or the back collection series number two let me know in the comment down below and i will be more than happy you guys uh to film one just for you but i need to see those comments coming my way i need to see the likes I need to see the subscription. I, I need to see people subscribing to this channel and supporting Ria Maria. It's much needed. Thank you so much, you guys. Like I said, like and subscribe and let me know if you would like to see my back collection number two in the future. Till next time, new video, new content. Stay safe and sound. See you all next time. Bye for today. Mwah.